New overnight, the streets were taken over by that sideshow in the East Bay. Now, in this case, on top of the fireworks, law enforcement really had their hand full. Well, today in the Bay's Bob Riddell live for us this morning in the East Bay. This is where it took some time for the police officers to break up all of that. I mean, that looked like it could have been really dangerous and scary out there. Uh, correct. Unfortunately, we don't know of anyone being hurt during the side show, but as you're well aware, it's very a dangerous, illegal activity. This taking place in Antioch. We gave you a glimpse of that video. We want to show it to you again. This is a video into our newsroom. You can see there was a large crowd of people last night. This is in the area of Lone Tree Way and Blue Rock Drive, again, in Antioch. You can see they're watching those cars burn rubber, spin out, in a very dangerous activity known as a sideshow. We spoke with a deputy chief from Confire whose agency responded to this sideshow. He tells us this went on for an hour in 20 minutes until Antioch police finally arrived and broke it up. We have reached out to Antioch police to see if they've made any arrests and to get their take on what happened. Uh, people were also setting off illegal fireworks at that side show. At one point, someone set fire to debris in the middle of the road. That's why Confire responded. Confire says that firefighters at Station 82, which is nearby that side show, they actually had to find another way to respond to one of their other unrelated calls overnight because the side show was blocking their normal route. And it was a busy night for those firefighters. Confire says they responded to 58 fires last night, including this brush fire that they tweeted out pictures of. Of those 58 fires, 50 were fireworks related, according to Confire. And one person was also seriously injured by fireworks last night, according to the fire agency. Reporting live here in the East Bay, Bob Riddell, Today in the Bay.